With this new feature, the delegate will be able to do things in a student's account, like view bill and make a payment, view grades, view contact information, view holds on an account, view emergency contacts, and view a student's to-do list. It's important to note that this delegate, whether a parent, a spouse, or someone else, can only see this information or take action after a student has given their explicit permission to do so. Granting, editing, or revoking permission all is initiated by the student. This can now be viewed in your My UH Self Center under the tile, Share My Information. If this is your first time logging in, you will be asked to first delegate access to a new contact. It is here where a student will input the information for their delegate, as well as determine what they want the delegate to do in their account. Next, click Authenticate Identity. An email will be sent to the student's UH account to verify their identity and continue the process. Once this is completed, the student and the delegate will receive an email confirmation. At this point, the delegate will be provided with instructions on how to create their own account. If in the future a student wishes to edit any of the delegates or the level of permission, they are able to do so by revisiting the Share My Information tile. Finally, our Delegated Access website is full of helpful information on this process, including a list of frequently asked questions. In addition, we have several step-by-step -step guides on how to perform common actions in a student account. Things like how to delegate access initially, how to revoke that access, how to make payment as a delegate, and how to review financial aid 